Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. Thank you. You may be seated. Wildcats, I'm Desiree. And I had to go home last night, but you can call me Josh. And welcome to the Morning Roar. So are we going to ignore the fact that you're wearing a horribly made bee costume? Hey, I heard folks in Rutherford Theater Troop accomplished a lot at last week's Thespian Regional Competition. Um, you heard right, Josh. The following students received a superior rating and took third place in the region. That's right. So now it's off to Nationals in Lincoln, Nebraska for these lucky students. Speaking of theater, today is the last day they're holding auditions for their new upcoming show, All Shook Up, After School, which we... Totally didn't forget to announce on Monday and this past week, but hey, academic tutoring is still this Saturday from 7.30 to 11.30 a.m. I didn't forget that, did I? <laughs> you said p.m. instead of a.m. last time. Okay, you know what? Good thing I remembered that this Friday is Meet at the Willow before your first hour, and last Monday's Poetry Out Loud winner is Tilly Jones. Congratulations. Just give it to Willow. Wildcats, I'm Nick today here with your weather update. Today we have a high of 73 and a low of 48. It's getting very sunny now because it looks like spring is here, so be happy for it's that. It's looking beautiful. Anyways, for the rest of the week, we're going to be around in the highs of uh, mid-70s, around 75, 74, about that. And the lows are going to be in the high 40s to low 50s. So yeah, it's going to be partly cloudy on Friday and today. And the rest of the week is just going to be completely sunny, so that's good. No more rain. So anyways, that's going to be it for your, the weather update. Now to sports, but first a quick commercial break. Hey, it's your boy, Devin here. And Jay with your sports announcements. Softball triads on February 6th, 7th, and 8th on the varsity field. Please go to the athletic office for an athletic packet if you're interested in playing. Today, there will be a boys basketball game versus Centennial at Centennial at 4 p.m. There will be a spirit line practice in the auxiliary gym at 3.30 to 6.30 p.m. On February 6th, there will be a girls basketball game at versus Shadow at Shadow at 4 p.m. Now for a quick commercial break. Stay hydrated. Thank you, Jared and Devin, for that sports update. Are you still salty that you're forgetful sometimes, Josh? Well, a club run down. On Tuesdays, media, cl media clubs have their meetings in room 604 starting at 2.30. Our club will also meet on the same day at in room 119 and 116 after school. On Wednesdays, go to Photo Club for their meetings in room 300 after school. Also go to Creative Writing Club in Miss Wen's room right after school. Pride Club will also happen every Wednesday after school in Mr. Ellis' room. Don't forget that DECA has their meeting every other Wednesday in room 718 after school. Show off your CTE skills and join Skills USA for their meetings in room 300 at 2.30. This Thursday, Drumline will have practice in both gyms from 6.30 to 9.30 p.m. If you have any suggestions or have possible things you want now, send them into our email at thewillowcandymorningroar at gmail.com. Our new shout of the day comes from Mirko, simply stating, Mirko respects women. I mean, shouldn't we all? In fact, shouldn't we all respect each other? Life lesson of the day, kiddos. Respect each other. And that's all we have for you today. Oh, but by, by the way, Desiree, I've been giving it some thought, and you're right. I am forgetful sometimes, and, well, I accept your apology. Wait, well, I wasn't apologizing. Never mind. Thank you for tuning in, and we look forward to seeing you tomorrow. And have, have a, a great, great day, Wildcats. Wildcats.